three things, three things to cheer you up. Here's number one. Now, we're all trying to continue living life as normally as possible under lockdown. Take Alicia Nashomowitz, who lives in France, an avid marathon runner. Alicia had been training for the Barcelona Marathon when his town was put on full lockdown and the marathon was, of course, postponed. But that didn't stop Alicia. He decided to run an entire marathon anyway, all 26.2 miles on his apartment balcony. He says it took him more than 3,000 trips back and forth and more than six hours to complete his balcony marathon. Alicia dedicated his accomplishment to frontline medical workers. Everybody was incredibly happy for Alicia, except for the people who live in the apartment right below him. I love that we find a way to keep doing the things we love. You know, for him, it's running marathons. For me, it's not running marathons. I love it. I don't understand it, but I love it. Moving on, after this much time under lockdown, I know I can't be the only one who is eating all of my meals over the sink. But here's someone who's still putting out cups and saucers for afternoon tea. Meet Kazuhisa Uexa, a 31-year-old performer from Japan, using his skills with a tablecloth to show his appreciation for others. I'm so thankful for healthcare workers and also thankful for that third saucer staying put. Yeah, that was tough. I mean, who's like, you know what tired healthcare workers need right now? I know. Go and get the blanket. <laughs> and finally, there are so many people doing what they can to help out during this pandemic. And it's so inspiring. Here's a story about one taxi driver in Spain who has been giving COVID-19 patients free rides to and from the hospital, which is fantastic. And recently, after he'd been doing round trips all day, he was called to the hospital to pick up a patient and was greeted by this. There was no patient. The hospital workers wanted to give him an ovation and they gave him money towards some of the trips that he's been making for free. What an amazing moment, so beautiful and such a deserved moment of recognition. Sadly, he was in there so long getting all of that applause, he actually ended up getting a parking ticket. That was three things to cheer you up. Three things, three things to cheer you up.